What's up and welcome back to Wonder Boy. Where uh Merry Christmas. Anyways, to where today I will be reviewing the Lego Creator Santa polybag. This polybag retails for four dollars, has sixty-seven pieces, and it's polybag three zero five seven three. Now let's take a look at the Santa. Okay, now the uh Santa build is probably my favorite polybag Santa ever. To be honest, uh, he does have a wrench here, which is just clipped on with a, which is attached to a clip. It, as you can see there, which represents his hands, so they are obviously in tan. And he has a little bit of white studs to represent like his, like that white fluff he has on his arms, on the part part of his jacket arms. I, I don't know. It's, Gold right there to represent his belt. I really like how they did the beard here. Really common eyepieces. They use a slope to represent his nose. Which from sideways looks really weird. But from the front looks really nice. Back some white. The hat is done very neatly. I do wish they did not expose those studs. Uh, the shoes. As you can see. Are really nice. Eyes. Overall this is definitely. Well Santa's dead. No Christmas. Anyways, uh, yeah, this is definitely my favorite Santa, but I'm I'm personally not good into reviewing like big characters. So uh, let's move on to the side build. For the first of our side builds, we have this table, which I think is undersized for Santa. It should have been like this tall, but I get it. It would have looked weird. Weird, but it does have a train there. Uh, well, it this build represents a train on the table, and I think it works really nice. And overall, I do like the table. Really simple design, but real nice overall. Now let's take a look at the second one. The second one is this present, which is used by having two jumpers. One on the bottom, one on the top. Uh, the one on the top has this golden stud attached to it. And then this red and uh two by two ooh, tile right there connect connected to the middle and it works really well to be honest and a minifig can hold it and it's not really oversized for a minifig to be honest because some gifts are really huge but I do but it is about the right size for the Santa fig itself well, so, uh, yeah. Anyways, that's it for this one. And, uh, let's move on to the final version. Here you can see the, uh, packaging. Just a normal poly bag. Nothing special. And here are the instructions. Set number there. There seems to be an ad for LEGO Creator right there. <laughs> yes, the, uh, LEGO Creator Sea Life one. Classic wind guy. Send it out. Real long instructions. I don't think I've ever seen instructions this long for a poly bag. But uh, anyways, let's actually move on to the final verdict. Okay, this is my uh, favorite uh, Santa build. So, and this is a pretty good poly bag. Definitely worth the price of four dollars, and would recommend it. And it's nice. It's a little nice side Christmas present if you're going to give it to someone. So overall, I would rate it a B. Plus. Anyways, I hope to see you all the next time. Good bye and have a Merry Christmas. Or Merry Christmas, I don't know.